In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a backyard bird box. A box like this can attract a diversity of backyard birds. The most likely birds that you'll attract are eastern bluebirds, black-capped chickadees, and house wrens. Make sure to pay attention to the details of the build to make sure that you're building a box that's most attractive to those native species of birds. Let's get started. The entire project can be made with just a few supplies. Start first with a six foot one by six of rot resistant wood like cedar. The piece that will become the top needs to be cut on a 15 degree angle. Follow the instructions to cut out each of the other pieces on the box and label the pieces as you cut them to make the assembly a little bit easier. The front access door and the bottom are set inside the other pieces, so they need to be narrower. So mark the four inch dimension and then use a straight edge to mark it and rip it with a saw. Then cut the two separate pieces from this narrower piece. Drill five quarter inch holes in the bottom piece to allow for drainage and airflow. Use a one and a half inch hole saw to drill the opening one inch from the top of the front piece. Use a utility knife to scour the inside surface of the front piece to help the chicks climb out of the box when they fledge. Start to assemble each piece of the box with outdoor screws. All but the front access door, piece E, will be put together with these screws. It may help to pre-drill the holes to avoid splitting the wood. The bottom piece should be set one half inch up from the bottom of the sides to reduce the risk of moisture getting underneath the box. So measure that dimension and then place the piece and screw it in place. Mark where the screws need to go for the top piece. But to make mounting it easier and to ensure a flush fit, it's easier to start the screws on the bench top and then drill them in place. Align the front access door flush to the bottom of the sides. Then draw a line across the top to mark where two nails will be drilled and become a hinge. Drill the holes and then place the nail, flip the box over, and repeat on the other side, making sure that the holes remain parallel the whole time. Now drill one more hole in the bottom to make sure that the access door can be held shut. Fill the box with cedar shavings before you place it. Make sure you don't use sawdust or other fine material that will endanger the birds, but many birds like to have cedar shaving or other nest material provided in the box. What birds you want to attract will determine where you place the box. To attract eastern bluebirds or tree swallows, place the box on a wooden edge in an open field. Hanging many boxes together will make the site even more attractive to tree swallows and bluebirds that like to have neighbors and multiple boxes in close proximity. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, be sure to leave them in the comments below. Bats are pretty picky in the selection of their roost habitats, and so the boxes are designed with some pretty specific recommendations to mimic those natural roost habitats and increase the probability that you're going to attract bats 